Hello, and welcome to Godly Play with Home Moravian Church. I'm Margaret Norris, and I am thinking that this is a parable. I'm thinking it's a parable because parables are precious, like gold, and this box is gold. Also, it looks like a present, and parables are like presents that already have been given to us. We can't take them. They're already ours. And parables seem to have lids that keep them shut, just like this box has a lid. But if we keep opening the lid, we'll find out what's inside. Let's see if this is a parable. Once there was a man who said such amazing things and did such wonderful things that people began to follow him. They even followed him to Jerusalem. And there were authorities there who wanted to know what he thought about sinners. And instead of answering them, he told them a story. He said, once there was a man who had a vineyard and he also had two sons. And he went to the first son and he said, would you please go work in the vineyard today? And the son said, no, I am not going to work in the vineyard. And then later, the son went to the vineyard and picked grapes. The father went to the other son and said, would you please work in the vineyard? The son said, I will. And yet this son did not go and did not pick grapes. I wonder which son, Jesus asked, is the faithful son? To which the authorities answered the first one. And Jesus said, you have answered correctly. The first one did what the father asked just like the sinners who repent and do what God asks. I wonder what the authorities thought of Jesus' story. I wonder what the other listeners thought. if you've ever been asked to do something and you've said no and then you've done it I wonder if you've ever been asked to do something and you've said yes and then you did not I wonder why Jesus told this story. This story is in the Bible. I'm going to light the Christ candle to remind us that Jesus is with us while we hear it. If you listen carefully, you'll hear the match strike. So we know this is a story about Jesus, and so not surprisingly, it's in the New Testament. It's in the Gospel of Matthew. It's chapter 21, verses 28 through 32. And this is Jesus talking. What do you think? 
a man had two sons. Now he came to the first and said, son, go and work in the vineyard today. No, I don't want to, the son replied. But later he changed his mind and went. The father said the same thing to the other son who replied, yes, sir, but he didn't go. Which one of these two did his father's will? They answered the first one. Jesus said to them, I assure you that tax collectors and sinners are entering God's kingdom ahead of you. For John came. John the Baptist, on the righteous road, and you didn't believe him, but tax collectors and sinners believed him. Yet even after you saw this, you didn't change your hearts and lives, and you didn't believe him. Let's pray together. God, thank you for this story. Thank you for this reminder that people may look like they believe in Jesus. It's when people act like they believe in Jesus that they can be an inspiration to us and to others. Help us to hear Jesus, to hear his voice and to follow him. In his name we pray, amen. And just as Jesus once was in one place and now is in all places, this light, which has been in one place now, will be in all places. Amen.